What's up, internets? I'm Tyler, and this is Tyler Doing Stuff. This is our first episode today. Something really cool what we're going to be doing is going to be looking at the world of wood turning. I had the opportunity to learn some woodworking and wood turning, and I'm going to be taking two blanks today and making two pins out of them. If you stick around till the end of the video, I'm going to be giving those pins away, and I'll show you how we're going to be doing that. So a little background on wood turning. So wood turning basically is, is you take a, a chunk of wood or a chunk of material, sometimes acrylic, and there's some true stone, which is kind of a softer type of uh, stone material, and you put that on a lathe. And that lathe will spin around for about 3,000 RPM or rotations per minute. And as you as it spins, you take a tool called a, a gouge or some type of carbide tool and you shave away and round out that material. I've had the opportunity to work with some of these materials now for about a few months. And trust me when I say that there are hundreds, thousands of people way better than I am. Uh, so this really isn't a how-to video, it's more of a watch and see video. I'll never forget the first time that I saw one of these turn pens and I thought there's no way that someone just made this in their garage. I needed to see how it was done. So I started watching some other videos and kind of meeting with some other people in my area and was able to kind of pick up this craft. The people who work in this craft love what they do. They believe in it, that it's fun for them. I met people with hundreds and hundreds of you know these wood blanks, you know, thousands of dollars worth of wood tools, and you can just see the, the pride they have in everything that they make. Now, here are the two things that we're gonna be working with. One of them is acrylic, and one of them is just what I what's called Bethlehem wood or olive wood. I don't have any authentication. I don't know if it's actually from Bethlehem, but that's what they tell me it is. These two pieces are hopefully we'll be able to turn them into this, and then hopefully turn them into these pens at the end. Well, I guess you just saw the pen, so you know we actually make it there, but we'll show you the process in between. Now that we know what we're working to, we're gonna head over to the lathe, and we're just gonna do a little time lapse, and I'm gonna show you kind of how we did this. So the first thing we do when we get out to the lathe is that we're gonna put our blank, this is the Bethlehem olive wood, onto a pen mandrel. And this is gonna let that thing spin around super, super fast and let us kind of take away that material. As I kind of start, sorry for the shaky camera, you can see just slowly, slowly that material is going away and rounding out where it needs to be. After we get it rounded out, we're going to sand it down with a multiple grit sandpaper and then we're gonna polish it up with just some some type of um, an oil wax type polish that's going to make it shine and look really nice. Really pop out those grains and those colors that you can see right there. All right, we're back. We just got back from the lathe. We grinded all these materials down. So I only showed the wood uh, because when I did the acrylic, it wasn't as clean as I was hoping it would be. Uh, it came out really beautiful, but the process of it looked like trash. And so, y'all didn't need to see that. Because of how fast that lathe was spinning, I know that camera was shaking a little bit, but hopefully at the end of it, you were able to see from what it was to what it turned into. And here they are, the two pens. Let's get that focus right. So here is the acrylic pen. And here is our Bethlehem olive wood pen. If you can see, I, I'm leaving the glue tips on them because we are going to be giving these ones away. I don't want you to think that I've been using them and I'm sending you, no I'm sending you nonsense. In order to win these pins, here's how this is going to go down. You need to like, subscribe, comment on this video. When we get 25 subscribers, I know that doesn't seem like a lot, but for, for new channels, that's what we're hoping for. 25 subscribers, and we're going to pick two of the 25, and we're going to send these out to them. Um, really, really proud of these pens. Actually, they came out to be really beautiful. And I think whoever gets them will be uh, lucky to have them. That being said, thanks for stopping by the channel today. Hope you learned something. Hope you saw something cool that you liked. Um, once again, like, subscribe, comment, and we're going to see you next time we're doing stuff. This is Tyler. Peace.